okay, well, that's Fire Emblem. Fire Emblem, yeah. Yeah. To be honest, I haven't played, like, any of them. I really like Awakening. Yeah. Fire Emblem Warriors Three Hopes. Oh. I think I heard a rumor about this. They're making a new Warriors that's three houses. I haven't ever really been much for a Musou game. I've never really been into it. I seek to destroy the irrational power structure. Oh, the frame rate of this game. See, that's just the thing, man. Switch games always look awesome until you see. Especially Warriors, because Warriors put so much stuff on the screen, it cannot keep up with. Yeah, I just can't. Damn. In the trailer, it's that's you putting your best foot forward too. <laughs> that's how I felt about Arceus when You're they showed right. Pokemon moving in five the FPS. The game is way better now, but that, mm. that trailer was not good. No, no. We shall fight. We shall survive, and we shall win a glorious. I'm curious what this story is. Now that I know, I, I you know I couldn't even guess because I, I didn't play Three Houses. Well, I haven't played it yet, but. I, through reasons I have an inclination of stuff that happens. I'm curious where this takes place. Actually, this looks like it's the in-between period. So, it goes from Academy, Byleth wakes up, and then you're just, everyone's older. And like uh, the blue one has like a scar, or, or like a, uh, I don't know if he has a scar, but he has a, this, one of his eyes is covered. But in this, it isn't. They all look slightly younger than that. So I think this is a in between Academy and the the other half, second half of the game. I lagged a little bit, so I am going to catch up. What uh, what time are you at? Thirty-two, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. We've got more in Alright, I'm at uh, Advance Wars, Advance Wars. Two. Yeah. Boot Camp game. Alright, perfect. In the first campaign, Advance Wars, you'll advise a colorful cast of commanding officers and use their abilities in vibrant You know, okay, battles. here's the thing, man. Each I don't think the art style really bringing even more charm well. to these characters. Or I, I just prefer the Game Boy Advance version. I don't know, I think it looks better. I like I like the, the way their sprites are on these screens. Mm. No, I like the sprites. I don't like the 3D model. Oh, you mean of like? Oh, okay. So you're saying of like the tanks and stuff? Yeah, the tanks. They don't look good. Okay. Yeah, I can see that. That's fine. It's not bad though. Like I, I may still get this game, but I'm not. I'm not that pumped for it. But you know, I'm gonna sell. Probably pick it up. Yeah, I played a. There's like an Advance Wars like online thing you can play, and I. Oh, you can actually make maps. That's cool. I played Jummer with it, in it. Definitely got messed up. Oh, there's online multiplayer. Boy, well, it should, but it's Nintendo, so you never know. You never know. One plus two reboot camp marches onto the Nintendo Switch system April eighth. Pre-orders are available. Only Advance Wars I played before with Days of Ruin. That game was hard. <laughs> that game was super hard. Wait, they're putting this on Infinite Universe. Work on Switch. In No Man's Sky. Oh. Every star <laughs> is the light. I'm like, I, it's a space game. I don't know what it is. Oh, it's No Man's Sky. Oh. Yeah. Orbited by planets teeming with life. I mean, the, I, travel to planets of your choosing. I don't know. This game isn't the most like, intense. It's just gonna be I very like blurry. Yeah, it's gonna be very blurry. And like looking I, I at this, definitely looks very blurry. Well, here's the thing, too. I would guess that this game is CPU intensive, and I don't know if this would be able to like tools. do anything with that. But you know, who knows? I'm not a game developer. In this living and breathing universe. I think it's not going to be sharp. And like you saw that guy's moving in low FPS. So they just lower FPS of people that aren't important. They lower uh, stuff's blurrier because they're not using anti-aliasing and stuff like that. Yeah. And, and here's the thing too. I, I would always like, for the most part, love playing a lot of these games on Switch. But I feel like I'm playing a compromise. No, yeah, yeah. yeah. And like that's the frustrating part. It's like, yeah, I'd love to play No Man's Sky on my Switch. Like, hell yeah, it's awesome. But not at 10 FPS. <laughs> I mean, that looked like 60. Yeah, <laughs> that'll do. <gasps> Who is this? Wait, is this Mario Strikers? Wait. Finally. Oh my God. They actually bring it back, Strikers? Yeah. Oh my God, I'm so excited. <laughs> Way too long. It took them ages. What was the last one on Wii? Uh, yes. 
the charge. It's the last one on the Wii. Mm. Okay, so they're calling back to the old art style. Right, which is fantastic. So I wonder if it does that in game though. Strikers, oh my Prepare god, new strikers. A five on five sport like soccer that's way heavy. I can't wait Bro, to we, play this no, we have, we have to. They they surely they have good online on this, well surely. Yeah, but like we're moving my ass kicked. It's not like when we were kids, I was good at it, but <laughs> uh, we can still uh, we can still get there. It's fine. Uh, okay, the specials do call this back to the old art style. That's sick. Yeah. I used to just play as Toad and then flip over the goal. Yeah, <laughs> it was great. I think we had Luigi Captain and a Toad team. Mm -hmm. and then that one group just raised green. <laughs> okay, he can customize them. Why does he have a scouter? Customize as you see fit. Second, the hyper strike. To activate this shot. Talking about this game for so long. I know. Also, you don't you have multiple main characters. It's not one main character and a bunch of like other characters. Oh right, yeah, I that. Up to eight players. Whoa, what? Can compete against each other on one Nintendo Switch system. Oh yeah, if everyone uses the Joy-Con. Yeah, yeah, the Switch can just take eight controllers anyway. Online club? Up to 20 p. Okay. This is kind of sick. So we're playing this, yeah? We're playing it. Have fun. Oh, I'm 100% playing this. Oh my god. Give me my ass kicked. With items. I've waited so long for new strikers. I have to play this. Yeah. <laughs> well, let me know if Toad can jump over a goalie, then I'll, I'll get the game. That's, that's the only thing I need. June 10th. Yeah, they do release some a Mario sports game like every other year. Right. But strikers? Yeah. The latest iteration I'm so Mario excited for that. Is coming to Nintendo Switch. We hope you're excited for this Anything Goes Battle Soccer game. Next, please I hope characters still have animations and stuff. They might have just taken those out because uh, some of them were. No. Uh, Waluigi when he was, uh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> forgot about that. What is this? So I thought Splatoon 3, but not seeing that helicopter. Mm. Oh, it is. <gasps> just have it run. Yes. Okay, this direct is great. Okay. This direct is great. I gotta pause mine for like two seconds. I think I'm a little bit ahead of you. Okay. Please tell me this is up all the time. But Salmon Run is back. It's cool. I just hated the fact that it was so random. I so disliked it. it. You couldn't just it's do so it whatever. I hope they change that. Why does Nintendo like stopping you from playing games? I don't Like, know. why do they do that with everything? I'm just, I'm like, I thought for sure they were bringing this back, so I'm just glad to see it confirm. Mm -hmm. You know, I still haven't finished the Zuku. It's a good yeah. game. And the Octus version is really good, too. That That's the issue, though. Oh, here is the issue. New you can't bosses. transfer your, your saves in uh, Splatoon 2. So I lost my save. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but they have new bosses. Okay, so you have to help them get out of it. And if you, okay, that's cool. If you hit it, he just hits the ground. Can you throw them now? Oh, you can throw them. I love Summer Run. I yeah. please be up all the time. I played this so much. Nope. Nope. Okay, new specials in the mode. I mean, horde mode's always fun in these games, right? Like that's something you you should the horde modes always have. Can you? Oh, you can throw them into the goal too. Perfect. That's great. Do we know when it's coming out, Splatoon 3? No, this direct should possibly tell us when we don't know for sure. Yeah. New Super Boss Salmon? <laughs> <laughs> Next wave is what it's called, okay. Please don't be timed. That's, that's all I ask. 
I, I'm just it, glad it, it's there because it's like there's no way you get rid of it. Join, join Salmon Run once a month. Okay, please come on. Tell me it's not time. One that's never been seen before was also spotted at the end of the trailer. Will the Inklings and Octolings ink or swim? Splatoon three will. Yeah, we don't have we don't have a date still. I kind of figured it would be this summer or this year. Oh yeah, it's we know it's this summer, but they didn't give us an exact date. I thought they would. Oh, okay. This is a great switch. This is a great one for me so far. Those two things I've been wanting. I, yeah, I don't really. I'm, this one seems fun, but like it's not something I'm really hyped for. Give me Bayonetta. Let me kill some. Let me punch something. I mean, we know it's coming. Finally, we've seen it. <laughs> Took ages. Uh, this is looking like XD Gale of Darkness uh, to me. This isn't Chronicles. Yeah, okay, no. Okay, okay. Front mission game is I really like the mech game, it's not really... Oh, Ooh. tactical, oh! Oh, this is kind of cool. Okay, I do like tactical. Did you get the uh, triangle strategy? It's like successor to the Final Fantasy Tactics series. Okay. It's coming, that's, I think that's coming out this or next month. Okay. I, I've actually always wanted to get Final Fantasy Tactics. I never got it, though, but I always wanted to play that. And Triangle Strategies by the uh, the Octopath the Bravely Default line. Studio. Classic. Okay. Front Mission One Remake launches on Nintendo Switch this summer, and in the future, the sequel Front Mission Two Remake will also launch on Nintendo Switch. Get set for a high octane. This is what I want. Let's go. Race. This is what? gonna be the best kart racer ever. From the creators of the asphalt series. Come on, let's go. Look at this. Come on. You can be Mickey. Oh, why is everyone from... making kart racers? You could be Mickey Mouse from uh from Kingdom Hearts. What's what's funny is this this might be pretty good. Let's see who's the developer. <laughs> Maybe I should have watched you because I am at a commercial. Right. I can just throw it up and then Discord. Yeah, let's just do that. Yeah, I'll do it. Well. At the last second. I don't know why I'm just watching it on YouTube. Let me just do that. With new seasons added regularly, bringing more exciting Disney. True, I could have done that. I just I'm used to doing this. That's all right. It's it's safer this way because YouTube will show you too much. Online multiplayer modes. Disney Speedstorm races onto Nintendo. You should have sound because I did. Oh, I have to do desktop. Hold on, I'll change that. I'll change that. Dive into these classic franchises on Nintendo Switch. Unleash the power of the Force in this classic Star Wars action adventure. Okay. As Star Darth Wars Vader's Force secret and... apprentice, you'll use devastating Force powers and Even lightsaber combos see. as you hunt see. down Jedi Masters on iconic planets. Huh. Upgrade abilities like Force Grip. That should have worked to get let you hear it. Them for even more destructive combos. Mm, nope. Use button controls or opt for motion controls enhanced from the original Wii version. You can also duel locally with a friend to determine who is the galaxy's most Because I do this. Jedi. Star Wars, the Force Unleashed, All right. launches on Nintendo Switch. You definitely can't hear this. Oh, it's Force Unleashed. I wouldn't even pay attention. You can't hear that, yeah. I can hear it. Oh, you can? Okay. Mm -hmm. of legendary assassin Ezio Auditore da Firenze awaits in three critically acclaimed How many times are they going to re-put this game out? These games, Italy. These games are amazing, but I've played them. Right. And, and beat all of them. They kept making the same game over and over. I just... Like one, like the first the trilogy was fine, but even the third one, I couldn't finish. Yeah, yeah at, though, after, like, like, Brotherhood... Or, after uh, Revelations, people just fell off. They did too much. Right, right. Optimized well, Revelations display. is a that's the third one too. Right? Yes, yeah. The yeah, but that's, second. that's the only yeah, one I didn't finish was Revelations. I didn't finish Revelations either. Pilot mobile suits in dynamic action RPG battles. Strange incidents called. So I don't know if you saw, but this whole like section universe. is just classic Find games on Switch. Oh yeah, yeah, I saw. Okay. You'll lead three mobile suits in battle. Enhance but even Force Unleashed, it looked. <laughs> It looked worse than the 360 version. <laughs> yeah. Like, I know I know it's not the point of, like, video games. They don't all have to look Well, like it's the thing great, about the Switch is all these games have to be, be able to be played portable. So they right. focus on that before they make them for people who are just going to play it docked, which kind of sucks. Right, right. And these games weren't built oh, there it is. to be, like, optimized. Oh, Chrono Cross Remastered. This was leaked. The protagonist this looks the same though. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this. Oh no, it's a remaster, not a remake. Never mind. Yeah. yeah, yeah. How did this happen? 
What is this mysterious another world? Travel back and forth between both worlds. Fast enough to play Chrono Trigger. I have a bunch of games Over to play. Over forty characters can join your party. I have Chrono Trigger for DS, but my college roommate loaned me. I need to give it back to him. <laughs> One day. A number of improvements have been made to this remaster, like the ability to turn off enemy encounters and a newly enhanced soundtrack. Plus, Radical Dreamers originally Are we playing a uh, new arc today? Is included. Wait, what? Are we playing new arc? Uh, I have to raid. I'm down after that. Okay. I got up to I'll, like 25. The Radical Dreamers okay. edition. Dashes and slashes. 25 unlocked uh, the crafting April professions. 7. Well, not crafting, but the gathering professions. And then I stopped in that town there. Okay. Okay, here's some more Kirby. Okay. Nice. Wait, what are you about to say? No, I was going to say, like, I, I wanted to work on my own streaming setup today and possibly stream us playing, but with this upload speed, I don't think that that's possible. Y yeah. I'll test it out later, but I can still set up my stream, just not stream. Never actually saw them change Kirby's shape. Ever when he absorbed something. What? What? I don't like that. Okay, well that was different. Latest unforgettable that looks like a Reddit shit post. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's gonna be over in a lot of places. But I've never seen them ever do that with Kirby. He always keeps yeah. the same size. Right. To rescue the kidnapped Waddle Dees, Kirby sets off on a new adventure. That implies there's something that Kirby cannot eat. Mm -hmm. Introducing mouthful mode. <laughs> Oh, well, why not just have him turn into a co What is this? Nah, come on. A vending machine to attack with juice cans. See, this he turns into a vending machine. Well, why no, not just no, have no, him no, turn no, into no. a car? His mouth is full. This is different. With mouthful mode, new actions will be available for Kirby depending on the object he inhales. I mean, it is I different. Like this, though, you can kind of turn into objects in a way. It's, like, it's a unique little spin on it. It's just Kirby stretching over something he's eating. <laughs> it's very Come different. A mouthful of water. Like yeah. As it's just weird that he's never once done this, but okay. New game, so let it happen. Yeah, we can build up Waddle D Town. At Waddle D's weapon shop, familiar copy abilities can be evolved. That's cool. Cut it a chakram. Evolve copy abilities to expand Kirby's range of So this is a cool way to change stuff. Yeah. Right. I, I like this. They'll also change Kirby's appearance and make him even I'm looking more forward to this power. game, but I, I'm not rushing out to get it. It's just so many of the games out right now. I just I really like 3D Kirby games. It's just very rare mm -hmm. even hidden forms so that this kind of stuff is sick because like i this is something i love with crystal shards is like mixing matching abilities together so them kind of bringing that back is really cool my issue with kirby games the whole is that they're they're so like, oh definitely ddd and it's like it's frustrating because i just want to play a regular kirby game and it's like nah this time you're going to be like a, some yarn okay there, there's, there's only a okay but you need like the two <laughs> <laughs> dog, dog. There's like no. There's a ton different. of like. Okay, I I know there's the good 3DS ones too, but. Please look forward to its release. Let's take a look at some more Nintendo Switch headlines. I mean, I get what you're saying because I definitely got those games. Like, oh, this is what I thought it would be. But there's like, there's literally like two games like that. It's a majority of normal Kirby. I'll give you that. But like, have you ever seen the Kirby start thing? How to play Kirby games? No. Kirby start. That's right, Otani son. MLB the show is coming to Nintendo Switch. God, this does not look that great. No, of course it doesn't. I need that uh that Switch Pro. That's not all. You can even play exhibition with a but the thing is, the Switch is selling so much, it outsold the Wii. You can also earn yeah. And like the lifetime sales of the Wii, it has outsold it. That's crazy. Is available. And take your progress on the go with you on Nintendo Switch. And a second, the second they make a Pro, the, s the lifetime sales of the Switch are going to skyrocket up again. No need to worry. You 
Unless it counts as a different console, which might be the issue. I'm going to send you this link, and you can look at it later, right now, whenever you want to do it. And you'll be surprised how many of the Kirby games are spin off titles. Why is there suddenly a Muppet? You're gonna have your hands full of games with these collections. Three Kingdom Hearts collections are almost here. From nope. Kingdom Hearts, they're on cloud. Hearts 3, Don't want it. And the Remind DLC. Every entry. If I have to be home, just want to play it on my computer. As cloud <laughs> that can be played <laughs> to the Definitely internet. own all those collections and, and have played the games sword. already. Don't I've not played the Final Mix movie. versions though, but I played the game. For the first time in TV, Big fan. See, I won't lie. Three doesn't even look Hearts, as bad as it probably would have looked if it was on the Switch. Containing all three game Which is unfortunately true. <laughs> what do you mean? If it was on the Switch, the Each footage of 3 would look much worse. The cloud version of that looks pretty okay. Oh, yeah, no, that's the thing. It, it looks fine, but if I buy I'm buying it on this, the Switch, I'm buying this, 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 I'm buying this. I have no idea what Klonoa is or was or who, who it's going to be. I'm buying this. I, I don't care about Klonoa. I'm just going to buy it. I might even play it. I'm buying this. Uh, <laughs> I have to buy it. So they actually bring Klonoa back. Also, Klonoa 2 is included. Take on these great adventures when I'm buying this. Klonoa Fantasy Reverie series. You sure you're not a furry? It's okay. Bro, why, why are you doing this? I can't it's just okay. like. I won't judge you. It's a smooth life, man. I can't just like some characters with a little bit of fur. I gotta be a furry, huh? That's crazy. All right, you can be a scaly. Then. Okay, bro. These award winning games. Okay. I don't know if I'd hate this. Portal on Switch sounds pretty good. However,. Cake? I can just I I've Still never purchased it to be honest, but I can just get it on PC for like a dollar or something. Cubes, lasers, I don't know if I I have Portal Two. I don't know if I have the original because I don't think I bought the orange box. Adds in local, yeah, online, I definitely and didn't. Split screen multiplayer modes, and that part's no lie. Neither is the sentient robot. I've also watched all of Portal Two because yeah, I like watching people play games. Nintendo Switch this year. Interesting to see them releasing this out of the blue, a but especially the fact that they're literally making oh, well, wait, but they're making the Steam Deck, right? Which can play Portal. So why even bother putting it on the Switch? It's it's literally one of those things where the Switch is selling so much. Every company is like we are wasting money by not having products on the Switch. That's 100% what it is. Hmm. Oh, Live Evil. I think this is it. Or is there something else? Or is it just alive? Outside of Japan, the RPG Live Alive makes its overseas debut. Oh, it's Live Alive. Okay. Multiple stories featuring different protagonists and time periods await. The order in which you tackle them is up to you. Prehistory: A tribesman comes of age in a world without words. The Wild West: A wanderer with a bounty on his head fights for his life. Okay, I kind of want to see gameplay. Imperial Let's... China. A Kung Fu is this an RPG or is it like a action? Twilight of Edo, Japan. A shinobi undertakes an important secret. Oh, that's this is gameplay right here for sure. Day, right. A martial artist strives to become the strongest there ever was. The near future, a youth know, with psychic kind of powers takes a stand against evil. This is RPG ish. The future, mm -hmm. a newly built robot is swept up in a tragedy in space. What other stories are on the horizon? You will repay my loyalty in death. Live Alive launches on Nintendo Switch July Is this by the same people who did um, Octopath? It, I mean, it looks, it looks, it looks like them. I don't know if it's the same team. I don't know who. It's who Square. I'm assuming it's the same oh, one because it looks yeah, like Octopath. It looks so similar. And it's a similar premise too, just a different yeah. like, setting. So it might be like them. <laughs> I did not see them doing this. You know, I'm surprised they don't just bundle the Switch with Switch Sports. I don't know why they didn't do that. Yeah. Here are the sports oh, look, they're not in a Nintendo these. Switch sports game. <laughs> you might recognize these three Yeah, the bowling was amazing. I never played this one. But tennis and bowling? Tennis. Used to do that with a family. Well, with Jordan bowling, I would just grab the ball and throw it. Or the bowling ball and throw it behind me. Bowling. I just love Switch bowling. Or, sorry, Wii bowling. Because it literally it copied like the exact way I would bowl. Yeah. So, like, I always enjoy doing it. This is cool. 
Three I wonder if there will actually be strategy with these games now. <laughs> like, Soccer. Maybe they might just put in some new stuff too. It's like this, like something that's not like just soccer. It's like super, super simple. By attaching a Joy-Con controller to the oh, leg strap accessory included with the physical version oh, of the Oh, included. Okay, I'm like, why am I supposed to get that? With intuitive <laughs> kicking motions. That's kind of cool, at least. Badminton. Yeah. Someone's going to get hurt. It's yeah, probably they're going to kick their TV. Right. <laughs> Keep the shuttlecock in the air. Unleash powerful smash shots to gain the upper so, hand. We have a badminton. I never in my life played that. <laughs> badminton. I think, no, I think we played at ACS or something, right? I I wasn't playing with you guys. No, I think it was a gym thing. Oh, maybe. I don't remember. Because I'm thinking about it. I was like, no, I definitely played it once. Because I remember how hard it is played. to keep it in the air. I don't remember how. Tennis. Do we play tennis? I think we play badminton. I don't think we play tennis at ACS. I think it was like... 100% play tennis at ACS. 100%. Where was the tennis court? They, well, there was no court. They just put up the thing in the gym. What do you mean? <laughs> they put up a net and they said go. I mean, we played volleyball just, like that. They know? didn't teach us how to play or anything. They like, just hit the ball back and forth for 20 minutes. <laughs> Horny teenagers, get the hell out of here. I'd like to show you some gameplay of one of the newly added sports, volleyball. Mr. Takahashi. Oh, <laughs> hello there, everyone. I'm Yoshiaki Koizumi from you think, Nintendo. You think we can buy wow, that jersey anywhere? I, I saw that jersey. It's like, wow, that's uh. All right. I'm surprised the Nintendo online. store doesn't already have that. Mm -hmm. They might. Honestly, wouldn't be surprised if you yes, get like a special version of this game that has that jersey. Yeah, yeah. But he's got shorts too? Yeah, okay. That's definitely go. something. That's getting sold. <laughs> that's too much work mm -hmm. for that to be just for this little pun. Pun? Yeah. Gag. Okay, gag. Not pun. There we go. No, 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 no. Nah. You sound like Kronika, though. It's Koizumi to serve with Takahashi up front. Who's gonna win? We begin with Koizumi. Probably the guy in the jersey. How will the opposing team react? Not the guy playing against his balls. Takahashi makes the block. Another one's coming. Koizumi saves it. A setup in the air, and here comes the spike. That was a very slow spike. Do you ever miss like the live Takahashi stuff with Nintendo? Cause I I, I don't. Okay. What do you mean, okay. like their E3 presentations? Like, yeah, like the old yeah the old school E3 presentations. I, yeah, this would have been not so great like that. Yeah, it wouldn't have worked. <laughs> they they definitely have uh, grown into this format very well. Yeah, I think so too. But I I just imagine like the fucking Connect stuff with the Connect kid like lifting his shoe and not working like you ever see the bottom of a connect of a what's the guy's name of, the, of an avatar's foot oh yeah yeah i remember that yeah, yeah. that i remember they're like we music drumming <laughs> yeah, I forgot yeah. About that. yeah. <laughs> no i i think that those performances were super cringe and i hated all of them I definitely prefer this. Just show me the games. That allows you to play soccer matches with a Joy-Con controller and the leg strap accessory. You can use the accessory to play shootout mode at launch. In addition, we're also planning a second free update this fall that lets you enjoy golf. No free updates like add stuff. Okay. And now, they literally just released a Mario to Golf game. Sure that you can all enjoy right. playing online. We'll be having an online play test before the game launches. To online play test, okay. That's something Nintendo has been doing recently. Mm -hmm. Definitely like to ask for your help with this. I didn't. I wasn't aware that Nintendo, but they knew that the internet was a thing. <laughs> oh, they do. You can tell from their DMCA attacks, they do. <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah. That's the only reason why they know about the internet. Thank you. That's all I have for now about Nintendo Switch Sports. I thought he was done. <laughs> I was worried. Let's see a few Not really. I saw Nintendo some cool Switch stuff, but I thought there would be more. I think 40 minutes was gone already. Yeah. I'm not too pumped. But, like, these are these are good games coming out. I'm just not that into them. I need, like, a Bayonetta. I need some punching, some kicking. Nintendo Switch system. Set in Omiko City, the sacred town for Taiko drums. You'll strive to become you know, I've been meaning to get this. Along with brand new I like rhythm games, but I have never, never played this series. Beats, including Megalovania. Okay, yeah, that's just Megalovania, yep. There's just a lot of good music in it. 
And that's not all. An orchestral version of the main theme from The Legend of Zelda is included. That's 76 songs total. Plus, Nintendo really likes Toby. Of a practice mode to replay sections of songs as many times as he'd like. Like Spider-Man? New modes have no. also been added. Uh, to Toby Fox, enjoy. creator of Undertale. A live concert mm. with up to four players in Don Chen Band. Or face off against each other in Great Drum Toy War. I think the thing about this is basically Donkey Konga. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Except they can update it with more music and stuff. Nintendo Switch this yeah. year. Plus, a paid in-game subscription service that gives you access to over 500 songs will be available at launch. Paid in-game subscription, but 500 songs is tempting. It's probably going to just be all the old songs. Switch games. Mm -hmm. But still. Still. Yeah. Oh yeah, this is the game I was telling you about. RPG game, Triangle oh, this looks interesting, here. actually. The protagonist, Sarah Noah, and his allies will be engulfed in the conflict among three nations. Your choices and yeah, Maybe after I finish Pokemon and then my Switch fate. backlog, I'm looking for. Is this a Square game? Yes, it's uh, the Bravely Lord Studio. Bound, Bravely Octopath. Yeah, with like world. games that aren't Nintendo, I can just wait. <laughs> the price will go down. Three will be available on Nintendo eShop later today. Save data from the demo can be transferred to the full game once purchased. Oh, oh yeah, so yeah, you can try. Oh yeah, the demo goes through More chapter two for sure, so you can go through those at least. Okay. See if you like it, because that that first part, I mean, they just told you that up to chapter three is there, so. Defeat a bevy of new bosses with wild personalities and even wilder attacks. The clever Miss Chalice is a new playable character. Take down fearsome foes with her double jumps, rolling dodges, and more. Cuphead, the delicious last. Yeah, I was wondering what they were gonna call her. Chalice is a Nintendo clever Switch name. June 30th. Not Cup Arena. A free update is coming to the Metroid Wait, Dread what? game. What's All the it update? Takes is one hit. Nope. Oh, what hit? Nope. KO update? Wow. No. Even once causes a game over in the brutal no. red mode difficulty. I mean, it's just funny that Nintendo is willing to do that. They normally just don't do this. Well, I guess there's an update, uh, sure. To the Metroid series. Kind of an easier version. Increased recovery with the newly added rookie mode difficulty. There you go. A harder mode, an easier mode. This free update launches later today. Like how it says, update. first update. And it comes out today. Probably see a lot more people playing some Dread. April will add a boss rush mode. Boss rush, okay. Battle bosses continuously, one at a time. The issue with this game is that as soon as you unlock everything and you feel Something's really good at play, like you, you feel competent, Switch. you know how to play the game, you've been practicing, killed all these monsters. The game ends. Like, <laughs> I, I get it's not supposed to be a super oh. long game. But still. So the creator of this series tweeted out this direct. You see his name down there. Mm -hmm. uh, now we know why. Earthbound is coming to the Switch. Through the, uh, I'm guessing through their subscription thing. So a big thing is if they release Mother and Mother 3. Because Mother 3 has never been released outside Japan. Wait a minute. Earthbound wasn't released already on the Switch? Why didn't they do that? Why, who's taking up so okay, long? Okay, so the thing about it is Nintendo does not own the series. The creator of Earthbound, but Itoi, he owns it. So oh, anytime they want to do anything with Earthbound, they got to talk to him. Oh, okay. Makes sense. Okay, that's Mother. That's certainly this is going to be the first Mother game. Yes, it is. So they, I think they're going to release Mother 3. Yeah, okay. Because we never got this. We got Earthbound. We yeah. did not get Mother. Right, right, right. And then Mother 3, people have played it because, you know, fan translations. But I think right. if we're getting Mother, I think we're getting Mother 3. You think so? I think they're finally going to do awesome. it. You ever see the unreleased footage for the N64 version of Mother 3? Yeah. Oh, they're not doing it. <laughs> no, no. They, they might still be doing it, just not right now. They're not doing it. Well, today, the Earthbound and Earthbound well, Beginnings. Well, that's kind of clever. They called it Earthbound yeah. Beginnings instead of Mother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, well, I'm lucky. That's that, uh, that was that Demon Slayer. Yeah, maybe in the next decade. When he, uh, we'll when finally, get, finally get Mother 3 outside Japan. Yeah, yeah. Maybe. Hey, we got the first game. That's something. Well, to be fair, right? Like, I'm going to go play that. However, they've already done that on the what was it, the Wii U. Pretty sure Earthbound was on the Wii U. 
virtual console. I don't even remember, probably, but... Yeah. The, the Wii U has the best virtual console. And Takes that's like all. the shittiest part about the Wii U. Takes them a while to do anything with mm-hmm. that series because of that. Right, right. It takes them a while to do virtual. Did this say Lego? Anyway. Okay, it's not. I thought it's a Lego platform fighter. It is not. It is definitely not. No, it, it was. Is that that multiplayer one? Right? It wasn't a full platform fighter though. That's what I was looking for. It's like some kind of like hybrid thing. Weird. Yeah, yeah. It, it looks bad. What did you think? Here's some news for Mario Kart fans. Many of you have been enjoying the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe game since its launch in 2017. So, we've been working Mario Kart on remastering and so select courses long. from across the Mario Kart series, and we'll be releasing them as paid downloadable content. <laughs> what? This Mario Kart Deluxe game released at the launch of the Switch. Hey, more DLC? I mean, it's cool. It's cool people like Mario Kart 8. I was hoping they were going to talk about 9 and not here's old courts. Old courts, old courses. Excuse me, don't you mean old boards? And nah, it's Mario Kart, not party. No, 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 no. Remember, I used to call level board levels boards back in the day. That's um, all right. In Mario Kart, in everything that wasn't like a particular, it wasn't specific to a game. It was just saying it's like, instead of saying level. You say I thought board. you used to say maps. Maps? I never said maps. <laughs> What the hell? I, um, I guess I got used to other people doing that. Yeah, I've never Mario seen that. Eight courses will be released at a I mean, I don't think it's this. Okay, that's a lot of... Never mind. I'll just be quiet. That's a lot of content. <laughs> that's a lot of content. Everyone is here. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> I was like, I was going to be like five courses. Why would I be excited about that? Oh, he released like 48. Okay, never mind. Okay, this is fun. Yeah, the mall is very classic. Even from Tor? Oh, actually, I didn't even realize that. What? This is fun. This is cool. I'm excited for this. I, I'm i now happy we can end the stream. I don't like Mario Kart 8, <laughs> so i Yeah, you that. don't. You're like, I'd rather play the Sonic thing. It's $25, but you get 48 courses. Kind of Yeah, it, it's worth it. Pre- why would I want to pre-order that? I just pay for what it comes out. Oh. Okay. That, that is a good deal. So that makes that expansion pass way more worth it. Because I've, I've been looking at expansion pass, like, why would I buy this for some old old NES and, like, some Sega Genesis games? I still don't think it's worth it. I think it will be worth it a year from now. I think that's when it will be worth it. But my thing is, if you get that, you get a $24 deal, and that thing doesn't cost $24. That, that to me, is worth it. Yeah, but I'm going to want to play Mario Kart 8 for a What is time. this? It looks, this looks like Xenoblade. Is it a Mega Megaton game? This or looks or like or? this looks like Monolith Soft. Mm-hmm. You know better than I do. Oh, this is Xenoblade. Oh, yeah, it's definitely not a Megaton. Game. Is this? Is this? There's no way this is X two. Yes. Bionios. <gasps> Bionios? Wait. Tell me, what would possess you to side with them? We're fighting because there are enemies. Okay, that that's Nia. That looks like a new Nia. Oh my god, this is Xenoblade 3. Fine for you, isn't it? All that time you've got. You could try, try to move forward together. His weapon looks like the Monado. That's a Telethia. Sword match. I love the big world as well. What is that great sword? What is when does this take place? Oh my god. It's the only way you're gonna defeat the real Did you play the uh, the Wii U one the I've Xbox? I've played all of them. Okay. I always meant to play that one too. I've been meaning to play this whole series. Okay, Nopons are already there. When, when, and where does this take place? Because, because like, this seems oh, this seems like a mix between the two worlds. I have so many questions. I love the art of Xenoblade. I love the. The idea of a story. I just don't think I can sit through the game. I feel like it's too long for me. Wait a minute. I think this is the two worlds brought together. Because that's that's a Titan, and that's the sword of the Bionis. Wait, what is going? Oh my god, I have so many questions. I'm so excited. <laughs> oh my goodness. 
console. There's Xenoblade 3. This year. What? Oh my god. That's like not that far off. Oh my god. This year, yes. The story of Xenoblade Chronicles 3 ties together the futures of the worlds depicted in Xenoblade Chronicles Yes, it is. Okay. And it will launch this September. It is both of them put together. Oh, I guess I gotta beat these games That's before that one comes out. Nintendo what? I have, I have, I have so many Thank questions. <laughs> I have so many questions. I, 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 uh, I, <laughs> I have, I have so many questions. What, what do you mean if he has the end? What do you mean if he has the end?